Understanding the Volume Weighted Average Price VWAP. The Volume Weighted Average Price VWAP, is an important technical analysis metric that investors and traders use to identify the average price and volume trends of a security over a given period of time. Unlike the simple average price, which gives equal weighting to every transaction regardless of size, the VWAP accounts for both price and volume to provide a more comprehensive view of market activity. How is VWAP calculated? The VWAP is calculated by taking the sum of all traded amounts for a security, price multiplied by volume, and dividing it by the total trading volume for the specified time period. The formula is VWAP equals sum of traded amounts divided by total trading volume. For example, let's calculate the VWAP for ABC stock over a trading day with the following price and volume data. Trade 1, 1,000 shares at $50 equals $50,000. Trade 2, 500 shares at $51 equals $25,500. Trade 3, 2,000 shares at $49 equals $98,000. Trade 4, 1,500 shares at $52 equals $78,000. Total volume equals 5,000 shares. Sum of traded amounts equals $251,500. VWAP equals $251,500 divided by 5,000 shares equals $50.30. Why is VWAP important for investors? The VWAP serves several important functions for investors and traders. Identify fair pricing. The VWAP provides an estimate of the fair price or average traded price over a period, considering trading volume. This helps cut through noise from short-term volatility. Trading Benchmark Traders often use the VWAP as a benchmark to determine if prices are relatively high or low compared to the average. For example, they may look to buy below the VWAP and sell above it. Trade Execution Large institutional orders are often executed by algorithms that use VWAP as a benchmark to minimize market impact. The orders are split and executed incrementally at prices close to the VWAP. Trend Analysis Plotting the VWAP over different time frames, for example one hour, one day, one week, can reveal insights into the direction and strength of trends for swing trading or investing. VWAP Trading Strategies Here are some common VWAP-based trading strategies. VWAP Reversion This strategy involves buying when prices dip below the VWAP support and selling when prices rise above the VWAP resistance, based on the assumption prices will revert to the average. VWAP Breakouts Traders may look to enter long positions when prices break out above the VWAP, indicating increased buying pressure. Conversely, breaking below can signal a short opportunity. VWAP Anchored Entries Aggressive traders may use the VWAP as a signal line to buy on pullbacks to the VWAP in an uptrend, or sell on bounces to the VWAP in a downtrend. VWAP Bands Drawing bands around the VWAP, for example 1% above slash below, can serve as dynamic support slash resistance levels for trade entries and exits. While the VWAP is most commonly used for equities, it can be applied to other asset classes like futures, forex, cryptocurrencies, etc. Keep in mind the ideal VWAP period, for example 1 hour, 4 hour, 1 day, may differ based on the trading time frame, volatility of the asset, and your individual strategy. Many charting platforms allow you to customize and plot VWAP levels. The VWAP is a powerful technical tool, but should be combined with other forms of analysis rather than used in isolation. By accounting for both price and volume, 
the VWAP helps investors assess fair value and identify potential buy, sell opportunities based on deviations from the average.